Hello, Rock Angel Sims here. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're going to be playing with the new expansion pack, Growing Together. I am super excited and I cannot wait to get into it. I've been working on everything for the past, well, since we've gotten it. So I'm um, just gonna get right into it. Uh, some things that's changed since we last saw this family because I did play with this family in um, my last video when I was like just exploring the infant. I did give them parents. Um, Alana's parents are here, Tracy and Isaac. And then we have Ian's um, mother, Gemma. So basically the storyline is Gemma raised Ian all on her own. The father skipped out uh, before birth. So she has been a single parent and she's very protective over um, Ian. Alana's um, storyline is basically her mother is strict always has been strict always been on her case and on her butt about getting a successful job getting married having kids and not knowing that now as a grown woman she is now strict on her kids as well um her father is like a little bit more laid back um he's a goofball he likes outdoorsy things such as fishing and different things like that. The mother, she likes to read books and, you know, just quiet time being to herself. And that is basically it um, with the parents. So I guess I will do a little home tour. Basically, I did not build a shell, but everything else I did. Um, so the windows. The whole furnishings, the coloring of the outside and inside furniture, all that was done by me. Like I said, the only thing I didn't do was the shell. So let's go into the house. Okay, so this is the living room slash kitchen area. I think it's super cute. I kind of had like trouble with um, knowing where I want to place things, um, but yeah. It, it still looks nice. The little living room area. A lot of this stuff is from the pack. Um, like this table, the chairs, um, that plant over there, of course, uh, the little baby stuff there and the little toy chest next to it. The chairs and the coffee table is also from the pack. Um, those little frames there are from the pack I think you can put like your own pictures in it I'm not sure I'm gonna check it out that lamp is as well these doors are as well and this fireplace and as you can see up here it's kind of floating but it's okay um, the little speaker and the little board games are from the pack as well so let's go here I don't know how they're gonna get through there. I'm gonna have to figure that out. I am bad with spacing. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pull everything forward because this is a bathroom and they're gonna have to get to it. <laughs> but um, this is the bathroom. Um, this tub shower combo is new. Those um, towels are new and I think that's about it. It's a nice bathroom. Now we're gonna go through the archway and let's start here. This is, uh, I gotta remember their name. <laughs> the um, one that wears all black. <laughs> You'll see in a few if you didn't look at the last video. But um, this is her room, super cute. Down this way is the older girls room the teen so the girls are downstairs she really has like this y2k type vibe which i like and i don't know why this is her <laughs> she's in the wrong room her room is down there <laughs> um so yeah i love her room but i think um the dark room is more my speed because i just love black and dark stuff so yeah um, and here's another bathroom this one is a tad bigger 
so yeah pretty nice oh yeah that's new the little potty I think it's cute so now let's go let's go no let's go outside first okay so I in my opinion outside looks plain to me but I tried like I said before I'm nowhere near a great builder <laughs> um but in this little shed is the place where we do laundry um, we have like a little outdoor grill area and seating area. Over there is a tree house that came with the new pack. And the swing set came with the new pack. So that's it for there. Let's go upstairs. Okay, this door is the parents bedroom. Nice master bedroom. Oh, I gotta get that <laughs> off the floor. Those were some vinyls. I was gonna put a record player in here but changed my mind. Um, this is the nursery. So right next door to the parents, which I feel like is a good idea. <laughs> um, this is the toddler's room. He has like this big space theme room that I think is so cute. I love his room. And this is a, another bathroom. With all these sims, you're going to need multiple bathrooms, trust. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going to go downstairs to the basement, which I forgot to put a guest room for the parent, the um, grandparents to come and stay over when they wanted to. So I had to like makeshift a guest bedroom. Um, so let's go down. Okay, so we're coming down the stairs. This is the guest bedroom and she's in here I don't know why she's in the guest bedroom she has a TV and the whole nine in her own room <laughs> um, and this is the guest bathroom so that is it um, I guess we can get to the gameplay I am so excited it's nighttime at the moment so I probably should get them to uh, go to bed so let's get that situated. Okay, Zoe, that's her name. I need you to come to bed. I need to set these alarms. This is by, um, this is a mod by Lot51. Um, let's see, create alarm. They go to school at around eight. Well, they do go to school at eight. So let's have them get up at six, 6 a.m. Manage weekly schedule Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do that for all of them. Give me one second. Okay, so I went around and set all the alarms according to their work or school schedule. Of course, the toddler and infant doesn't need one. Uh, she's still upset about that fire that happened in the last episode. No, <laughs> why? Aubrey, come and extinguish this, please. What do you mean you can't extinguish it? Okay, can you please put Kate into bed? It is 2 a.m. And he really needs to go to sleep. Uh, does he need anything? He doesn't, he just needs to sleep, good. Um, the dad can put um, Daxton to bed. Stop watching TV, please. Um, I, I understand, I know, I know. They're getting you. Did she go to bed? She did, okay. And uh, Aubrey, I need you to go to bed. Okay, what can you do? What can you get to? Oh wait, 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 she was telling him off. <laughs> like, he's an infant, why are you telling him off? <laughs> okay, why can't she get to him? Is it because of the mat? Okay, I remember the problem. It was the couch too close to the um, stairwell. Okay, great. Um, you guys are like leaving out, like I knew. <laughs> I already know, toddlers are going to get so left out like that middle child. <laughs> We're gonna try not to do that with um, Daxton, hopefully. I need to auto lights, all these lights, save some money. They better get to bed because um, they have work. Okay, yeah, he does and she does. So they need to get some sleep. And then after you soothe him to sleep, you can go to bed. 
he will go to sleep eventually. <laughs> I know that's a bad thing to say, but he will because there's nothing else wrong with him. Okay, there he goes. He's asleep. Okay, I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, it's not morning yet, but I did see this that came up. Um, a quark. I don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> Uh, revealed hates bedtime so Daxon does not like bedtime which is understandable but you need some sleep I'm sorry and he's gonna actually get up no sir no 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 I need you to bed I really need you to bed like you see this your your energy's low oh that moves I didn't know that's so cute okay now I will officially see you guys in the morning unless something else comes up okay the alarms are going off so, um, I need them to get up. She needs to start on some breakfast. I'm sorry, you guys, but I did get a mod that deletes, um, like house fires because it's just ridiculous and I don't feel like dealing with that. <laughs> I know it's funny, but I just don't. <laughs> I really don't want to have to deal with that. Let's serve eggs and toast. Fix them a nice hot meal before they get ready to go on their first days of school. I do want them to meet friends, the um, the kids. But of course, we're stuck at home. Well, they will be going to daycare, the two boys. Okay, can you turn that off? Thank you. Um, how is Kaden? He's probably still sleepy, he is. Um, he's hungry though. I might have him wake him up feed him and just have him go back to sleep he is so cute okay and he stinks okay so can you please feed him and then after you do that i need you to change his diaper so let's see these interactions he is such a cute baby i did give him some cc um this onesie and his skin details like CC creators work fast. <laughs> they are already pumping out lots of CC for infants. Oh, that is so cute. Um, sent alone. Can he like change his child first? Um, uh, go to work. Okay, the kids should be, their alarm should be going off. Okay, let's get them some breakfast before they go to school. How is his, uh, well, he's not hungry at the moment. He's just uh, very stinky. So I'll probably wait until she gets back because she goes to work in 53 minutes. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna let them eat. She's good. He went to work hungry, but it's fine. He can get something to eat from the hospital. Um, okay, so everybody's pretty good. While they're eating breakfast, I need her to come and change this child's diaper. Um, go eat. She's just standing there. <laughs> go eat and then use the bathroom. Okay, why can't you get through? Are you stuck? You shouldn't be. You got over there pretty well. Probably gonna have to replace this wardrobe. I like it though. Okay, now I'll go get some food. Why didn't she do what I asked her to do? <laughs> Uh, this is going to be a challenge. Use the bathroom, take a quick shower. I don't really care if you guys are a little late. I want your needs great before going to school. You use the bathroom and then take a quick shower. Can you please go and change this child? I know for a fact you can get by now. So I know that's not an issue, but I can tell that there is a bug and I've watched other people say that they have it too. That if you, when you ask them to do anything with the toddlers, it's like a delay. I don't know why. I don't know what's going on. Let me reset her. She's just not doing anything I ask her to do. Okay, let's see if she does it now. It's like she keeps, okay, there it goes. It went away and then came back. But I get it. This was a huge update. So of course things are gonna be buggy that's with any game do you guys remember cyberpunk <laughs> that game was all sorts of buggy okay this is my first time seeing this animation no change his diaper what are you doing he needs to go back to bed 
Okay, they are off to school. I think I'm gonna have them make friends for the first day. Oh, he peed. <laughs> Pee on caregiver milestone. <laughs> That's a milestone. Ew. He is so cute. I love him. Oh, they just became good friends. That's so sweet. Okay, now can you please put him back to sleep? I know, I know, I know, I know. I think when the girls come home, we'll go to the celebration center. She has work in a little bit. Oh no, she has work now. <laughs> go to work. But you know, her family obviously comes first. Um, Ivory wants to invite over her classmate Savannah. Um, sure, she can go to the celebration center with you. Ian brought home 144 simoleons. Great. I don't think any of these is like really new. I'm not gonna have Zoe do her project because she's gonna be one of those like only gets by in school type thing. <laughs> So she'll do her homework every so often and do no projects. Um, Aubrey will turn home with school project. Aubrey would definitely do hers. She can do hers at the center. Okay, so yeah, nothing is new that I got. Um, this child needs to be bathed. So let's do that really quick. Uh, come upstairs and give a bubble bath to Daxton. After all of that, we'll head out. You didn't even bring home a friend? Zoe, why? Oh, new family dynamic strict. When it comes to Ian and Daxton, a sense of order seems to abound. Ooh. <laughs> As the younger Sim has a deep respect for their older family member, often meeting the older Sim's high expectations. For family members with a strict family dynamic, the, o the older Sim will ask the younger Sim to do things like cleaning more and the younger Sim will generally av avoid rebellion, though both might get more stressed overall. Would you say that Ian and Daxon have a strict family dynamic? Now if it was the mother, yes, but he is supposed to be like the chill laid back as long as they get their schoolwork done and things like that, which he should instill it more in Zoe. He's pretty chill, so I'm gonna say no. Now if I do get that for the mother, then definitely yes. But I did put in there family dynamics already in Cass that she's strict with all of them except for the husband, of course. She's just have a close with him. Uh, sleep through the night mouse don't unlock. Oh, so he can now sleep through the entire night. Oh, that's so sweet. That's so cute. Oh, she has like a little picture. Did she draw that in school? <gasps> she did. That is so cute. She must have like an art class in school. I remember art class when I was in elementary school. That was my favorite class. We'll put it here. That's so cute. She's not going to do that. So I'm going to sell it. She might will do her homework and that is probably it. <laughs> And she's not going to be doing that every day. Why don't you get your homework done? And you can talk to your friend. Um, friendly. Let's gossip. Share San Sequoia's secrets. Um, hobbies. Ask about hobbies and skills. It should not take that long to bathe the child. The spoiled salad from the old house. Oh no, there's nothing in there. I hate that. This is a CC trash can and when you put one thing in there, it looks disgusting. So the mother is back. She brought home 135 simoleons. And Aubrey found out that Savannah likes painting and video games. Okay, that's cool. Here's the grandmother. Let's go to the fireworks and hijinks festival. Mother, we are very, 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 very busy. We have uh, four kids and a husband. <laughs> so no thank you, not today. Um, Let's go to the center. I'm just going to go with Aubrey, Zoe, and Savannah. So I will see you guys when we get there. Okay, so we are at the Celebration Center. And I think first thing we're going to do, well, let's look at it first. So uh, you come in through this way. These are some chairs. I love these chairs. Bathroom, a little changing station, a gym. Um, this is the front desk. I probably should get that front desk um, mod back. And like, it'll always have a person sitting here at the front desk to make it look realistic. Um, shower rooms, slash bathrooms, a little playpen area, a little kids area, a kitchen, um, games, okay. And a little outdoor area, this is really cute. And a music area. 
an arts and crafts area or just creativity and computer stations and more bathrooms okay this is really cute i like it um let's look around do they have a vendor anywhere close by because they are pretty hungry and it's raining i'll probably just have them make a salad or something because i don't see any vendors so one over here oh this is a little water park we're gonna have to come here one day when it's not raining let's just go here and get a quick meal ham and cheese sandwich did she do her homework she did this is lighting up what's going on oh she has neutral confidence that's new um first day of school okay she also want to learn how to ride a bike i did get her a bike we'll do that one day um anything else okay so she has a compatibility thing um open sim profile also she has good compatibility with her sister which is kind of weird because i wanted them to be kind of like at each other's throats like how sisters are <laughs> um they're yeah they have a difficult family dynamic so um i don't know why their compatibility is good but maybe they're just still compatible but just still difficult i don't know <laughs> um okay she has one with her grandmother as well uh let's see bad compatibility oh my gosh why <laughs> Also, she's not compatible with her grandmother at all. Maybe because her grandmother is kind of like this. I didn't want to make her high maintenance because that trait is annoying to me, but kind of like on that side a little bit and a little bit overprotective and maybe she just don't like that. I don't know. Okay, come and get a sandwich. And after um, Aubrey finishes her sandwich, we can get started on her projects. Savannah can help her. Oh my gosh, there's a ghost. Why? There's children here. I don't think Savannah can help her with it. It's fine. Wait, I think I can have her help control Sim and she can help assist with the project. And then I can just click on her again and not control her. That mod is so handy. Is she not going to? Okay, there she goes. Why is Alana calling? We're thinking about having another baby. No, 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 no. We're not having any more kids. No. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have her come and play some games. Let's let her meet some um, other kids. I don't know why I'm experiencing a lot of lag, but I am. Why don't you do a friendly introduction to both of these kids? Oh, that's orange. We can attempt an introduction, but she's not going to like keep trying over and over. That's just not who Zoe is. Where is Zoe? Oh, there she goes. I don't know why I can't see her queued up stuff. Okay, she's fangirling. You know what? Just don't even worry about it. <laughs> um, come and play a port game. Change game. Let's play. Should we do puzzles? Let's do puzzles, that's new. Choose a puzzle, let's do a 50 piece. Let's do a sci-fi, cyber bunny. Where is she going? Oh, she needs to use the bathroom. I'm just gonna cheat that a little bit. <laughs> My game is so laggy. May have too much stuff in here, <laughs> but I did update my mods, so. Okay, so she finished her project, nice. Can you come and help your sister out with her puzzle? That would be really nice. We're gonna have to go home after we do this puzzle because it is getting pretty late. But I wanna have a puzzle for her to frame and put in her room. Aubrey seems to be enjoying the song. Should she embrace a love of soul music? Sure. They have not fed this child whatsoever. <laughs> I'll just fix that a little bit. That's ridiculous. I feel like some of the needs should go up for the toddlers and well, for all of them, like when you're away, it just makes sense that they would take care of their kids. <laughs> Where does she go? Okay, the puzzle's done. So why don't you uh, frame it and then we're gonna go on home. 
so let's go on home. I will see you guys when we get there. Okay, so we're back home. I would, okay, something's really going on, seriously. I don't know what it is, so I'm gonna have to figure it out. And it seems like it's, yeah, I don't know what that is because um, I updated my mods and all the mods that I put back in or re-downloaded have been updated, so I don't know what's wrong. Either I made a mistake and kept something in or a bug is still going on with the updated one. So I'm going to have to see about that before I post the next episode. But um, I'm probably going to have to end it early because of that, which sucks. I wanted to play for a little bit. Um, Alana, what do you need to do? You need to file court documents. Um, it's really late. How's the child doing? Let me save and come back out because they won't even let me press anybody else. Yeah, something's still wrong with it. I came out and came back in and it's still acting weird. So, I'm so sorry. I'm going to have to cut this part short, but it is not like I can't even click on the baby or anybody else. And I don't know why. Um, can you at least, I don't know who I'm on. But can you at least um, bottle feed him? At the very least, at least bottle feed him. Okay, I'm guessing I'm on Ian. No, I'm on Aubrey. Okay, I'm going to leave out because... Oh, Babel Milestone. Okay, so he learned to Babel. Okay, cool. But I'm going to have to cut it short. I'm so sorry. I hate the fact that I got to cut it short. Um, because my game is like gone out the window right now like it won't let me click on anybody and they're getting hungry and crazy and I don't want anybody to die or anything so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video Ugh, bummer <laughs> but um, don't forget to like share and subscribe bye angels